Hey guys, T Man J twenty four TJ back at again with another diecast review. Today we're going to take a look at Danica Patrick's two thousand and ten number seven Goodyear Chevrolet for Junior Motorsports that she drove in her ARCA debut at Daytona in two thousand and ten. Take a look at the box. You got gray, but gray, white, black box number seven Junior Motorsports Goodyear Junior Motorsports got a render of the car right there. Two thousand and ten. Danica Patrick, Danica Patrick, number seven, Go Daddy, 2010 Impala, one of 2010. <laughs> Arca, Arca Racing Series presented by Remax and Menards. Huh. Danica Patrick, render of the car right there. I didn't know Arca was brought to you by both of them. I knew they were sponsored by Remax for a while, and now they're the Arca Series presented by Menards or some shit like that. But whatever. So let's start from the front. You got Impala, number seven, Go Daddy. You got GoDaddy.com on the hood. Arca is on the windshield banner. You got your Arca contingencies. Well, you know, what Danica ran of the uh, Danica can or the Arca contingencies. Number seven, you got your Good Daddy logo. You got GoodDaddy.com, www.beatthematch.org. Safety clean, Miller welders, racing electronics. Nothing on the C post, B post. You got Dupont, Pure Later, Bosch, Peak, and I think that's some. Um, Logo, uh, champion or some something like that, but I can't read it. Got Danica Patrick's name on the name rail. Got the rookie stripes. You got R and B in the tail light. Two GoDaddy.com logos. I don't know why that looks kind of dumb. Um, they should have made this one just go. Whatever. I don't know. Anyway, peak performance on the deck lid. It's number one thousand one hundred and. 23 and this side is the same as the other side let's take a look under the hood back oh no. roof flaps function so there's that that's until i can get the hood open let's see if i can manage Nothing on, well, Chevrolet logo. Then there's the engine detail in that. And there is the fuel cell. And here is the bottom of the car. Danica ran this, like I said, in her ARCA debut at Daytona. She ran just one ARCA race and that was it. She got spun out and then she came back and finished sixth. So I really thought, you know, hey, she's going to be the female that's going to lead that's really going to come out here and win an NASCAR race. Finally, it's never happened before. And, you know, she's going to be the one. And, well, you know, we know she wasn't. So, uh, putting it in perspective, Eric Amarola, uh, he led more laps at Chicagoland. Uh, he led 70 laps in one race. He led more laps in one race than Danica did in the, like, five years she drove the number 10 car. So, there's that. Uh, Danica was just an overall bus. I think she maybe done a full year of ARCA, two to three years in Xfinity, then went to Cup. Uh, I mean, doing one ARCA race and then doing two half-assed seasons of, well, one half-assed season. Did she run you tell them? I can't remember. Anyway, whatever she did, don't do that if you want to make it to the top. Also, I mean, she's just, I just don't think she's that talented. It's just... She's not. I mean, you know, we we see that now. I mean, she was mediocre in the IndyCar. So, I don't know. That's enough for anything about Danica. Paint scheme, we got your green. Got your black. Got your orange. You know, a little bit of yellow in there. It, this, this is a really good-looking car. Uh, it, it is. You got... The green looks really nice. And then the black looks really nice. Especially with the black going down the side of the orange. Separating the green and the black. Makes it for a very nice race car in all actuality. Got your Hoosier tires. Uh, Arca does run, well, did run Hoosier. They run general tire now. So, if you're like, oh, Arca, if you don't know a lot about Arca, Arca is not NASCAR. So there's that. Arca is automobile, the American Automobile Racing Club of America or something like that. NASCAR is entirely different. So if you're, you know, confused about that. But yeah, I mean, this is this is her stock car debut. This is the car that she ran. She finished sixth. Had a lot of hopes, but then, yeah, she kind of fell off of it. 
But this has been another review. Uh, remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next video.